guys, it's Piper. <laughs> so today we're going to be making a book um, from scratchy scratch. And from scratchy scratch, I mean like, we're going to color the pages to make them look older. We're going to sew the signatures, press the book, which we don't have a book press, so good luck. Uh, we're going to press the book, bind the book. Um, we're going to, you know, create a cover for the book, put all the pages to everything. We're going to make a book from scratch. That's what I'm saying. Um, so yes, if this works out, then you get a video on how to make a book, a prop book. If not, then pfft, you get a fail video, but either way you get a video out of it. So hey, good for you. We're going to try and make a book, uh, an Arcana, Arcana book um, for LARP, my LARP probably will be pushed back. Um, I believe it already is, but if not, the LARP is for for LARP. But it's also great for cosplay, because if you need to make a book for your cosplay, then blah 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 blah. I'm really excited. So yes, definitely, um, that's what this video is. First, we're gonna turn on the coffee. Hopefully I have coffee. If we do not have coffee, then I will use tea. I'm gonna use baking soda and coffee to um, bring down the acidity. So hopefully that works. Okay, let's let's get into it. Hopefully I have coffee. If we don't have coffee, then like I, I will tell you that we don't have coffee. Okay, I didn't see any coffee in there. I didn't even see any tea. So it's probably hidden somewhere, but I'm going to Walmart f for something anyways. So maybe I'll just pick up some coffee while I'm there. All right, so the reason why I'm showing you this is because I want you to know exactly what paper I'm using. I'm using Canson. I love Canson paper. Um, usually I use their recycled notebooks, but this is their watercolor paper. It's the 15 by 20. I specifically got it that way so that I could fold it in half, you know, to create my signatures and pages. But the 15 inches was a little too long for me. So, I just took my ruler, cut down about three and a half, four inches, and it was perfect for me. So you can see me using my box cutter there because uh, I'm not cutting that with scissors. <laughs> Takes too much time. We did go get coffee. I made the coffee. We're gonna use these pans and I cut the paper already uh, to the size that I needed it to be. Um, so this is 30 sheets all together. So when I fold it, it's going to be 60 sheets. So this is going to take quite a bit of time to um, go in the oven because I have to do two sheets at a time. But for now, I'm gonna show you what happens with the baking soda. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna take our baking soda and I'm gonna go ahead and put Eh, like a scoop of this. Scoopity scoop. Okay, I'm gonna take just like this much and then just boop. Into the coffee. And I'm gonna stir it. And I'm just letting you know this is probably going to take a couple hours to do all of these sheets. Yeah. And then from there, I just put it on the paper and then we pop it in the oven.